released back in 2000. She was shocked, thinking I was asking about the intimate details of what position they had used, which room in the house they had conceived in, and so on. It had me hurt my friend that someone in the would get pregnant any other way than by having unprotected sex. And it hadn't occurred to me at first that someone would actually get pregnant simply by having sex. Does this sound familiar to you? If it does, then you're thinking these days that sex and pregnancy seem to be completely unrelated. You need to read this book. If you have to get off the phone quickly so you can hide your tears when your best friend tells you she's pregnant, you need to read this book. If you find yourself constantly becoming angry at your mother for not getting it, or worried, or you worry about your reaction, the next time someone tells you just relax and you get pregnant, if you've lost interest in your job, if you can't stand it that everyone know you know is pregnant, you need to read this book. December if you feel sad more than you feel healthy, cycle begins in the end. No use of lubricants. No dyspareunia. Rachel has pelvic ultrasound which shows the red fruit, retroverted uterus, but no other invasive reproductive studies or menses over here. On physical exam, weight is 257 pounds, blood pressure 130 over 60, pulse 84 in Rachel. Male build, male hair distribution, patient is overweight, normal skin tan and December skin texture, normal nails. Corolla with full extra muscular extraocular movements without conjunctival irritation. The orthopagial red mandrams are clean and the patient's teeth are in good repair. No palpable thyroid enlargement. No cervical lymphoid. Normal thyroid and moral pulses without vascular improvements. Lungs are clear to oscillation. Auscultation. No granulomastia. General sinus rhythm with no gallop. documentation of previous semen analysis on the patient's database in the UW hospital. I assume that there must have been an abnormality because of, the cause, of, the, cause of the being the cause of his referral. In the Assessment. Joseph and Rachel present with prim primary infertility in this marriage. The patient's January past medical history, his review of systems, his current lifestyle, and his physical exam do not provide any potential male
bottom left, medial oviduct is normal in size. November 15, But the fibriated oviduct never fills with contrast and no definite spillage is identifiable on that side. Impression conclusion. There's a three centimeter segment of the endocircle canal, which is somewhat narrow and irregular, with some small perpendicular structure, probably normal glandular tissue. Just above this, in the lower endo, you're